Hello, I'm Dr. Ardra Davis Tolbert. I'm a member of the New Delta Omega Chapter of Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority Incorporated, servicing the low country of South Carolina. We are promoting heart health. In the past couple of years, COVID-19 has taken a lot of our medical attention and rightfully so, but there are many people in our communities who have and continue to suffer from heart disease. Our challenge is an exercise routine. Exercise is one of the main things you can do to promote heart health. So get up, put on whatever you need to have on to make yourselves comfortable and join us. Good luck, have fun. We ask that you do this not just today, but as often as possible. Okay, now we are going to warming up. So we're gonna do standing little uh, yoga movement. So engage in your core, standing by heel in a seated position just the way you are, but keep it good posture. Ready, hands reach all the way up. Exhale, squeeze in the shoulder blade. Inhale, hands reach up to the sky again. Exhale, hands can be side away and then engage in your core and then squeeze the glute, bow forward. All the way down, bow forward, all the way down. Okay, without bending the knee, but just a micro bend there so you're gonna feel stretching the hamstring. Inhale, one vertebra at a time, rising up. So you're gonna stretch in the spine, one vertebra at a time, and curl your back. Inhale up, see the position the same way. Inhale, we're gonna same sequence in twice. Inhale up, squeeze in the shoulder, bray, hands reach up to the sky and bring to the side away. Imagine someone pulling your arm up to the side and a bow forward from the hip. All the way down. And the tailbone to the sky. So you're gonna really feel this the hamstring. And then one vertebra at a time, lumbar and the midsection and upper. And then one vertebra at a time, rising up. You're gonna really feel the whole body. And then we're gonna last sequence, inhale. All the way up. Squeeze the shoulder blade once again. Inhale, reach up to the sky. And bring the arm side away and bow forward one more time. Stretch out all the way down. There you go, seated position. That's very good too. Inhale, one vertebra at a time, rising your body up. One vertebra at a time. Okay, right hand onto the left, uh, right hip. And the left arm, uh, we're gonna twist the side of two sides. 10 times, exhale, inhale, transition, exhale, turn. Twist that, keep it engaging your core, make sure not collapsing forward. It's very important the warming up and then uh, before the exercise and then last exercise. Good, stretching. All right, back to the center. So wider feet, so wider feet. Stand it up here, hands on the head. That way you are the figure and lean into the left side and then one leg is gonna be straight, you're gonna feel the inner thigh stretching. Okay, one side, seated position, step the one leg straight. Yeah, there you go. And switch it to the other side, shift it to the other side. Stretching the inner thigh is very important too. Make sure you stretch out. I will recommend about 10 to 15. If you have time, 60 seconds at the best. And shift it one more time, each side. Yeah, this is a large uh, muscle and the hip, uh, hip flexor and the shoulder is very, very important. So make sure it's pretty well. And the other side again. Good job. And then back to the center. I'm gonna stop once, okay, DT? We're gonna go into before exercise warming up. So this is gonna be uh, very simple. So hands on the head, and then really Im very important to do, opens up the hip flexor. So right foot step back, and then a little bit bouncing down and forward, push, push to the forward and the back. Try to straight it, not to bend the behind the leg. Opens up the hip flexor. Right now, focus on the right hip flexor to open this right here. 
And the seated position is just to use your elbow or hands to open up the knee, push away from the body. And then uh, the hands are just straight up, just feel it. So that way you're gonna open up the hip place about 10 times. And go ahead, switch to the other side. Set. And then switch the left, a step back, and press the, uh, your hip a pillow bit to forward, for left hip. Yeah, try to stretch it now. Take your time to open it up. It's also very, very important. So now switch to the other side. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Press the knee away from the body. Knees makes me want away from the body. Okay. It makes me want to have fun. About but 10 about to 20 right repetitions. You have time. Right here. But don't rush it in. It you want to really feel when you start to warm it up. And the hip flexor and the shoulder is very, very important to do. And before start exercise, so make sure you do uh, warm it up very well. You don't want to end up. You don't want to skip this one. Okay. And stop right here. And now we're going to go. Move the knees up. That's also opens up the hip flexor. So now, see the position. What's different is knees push it away and then it come back. Knees push it away. You're gonna roll to the knees, hip is out, and roll to the hip. There you go, good job. Standing position. Uh, what's the difference is that make sure torso stay. You don't want to move the torso together at the same time the leg because you really want to open up the hip flexor. Yeah, there you go. Rotate it out. Rotate it out. All right. After that, now rotate it in, out to in, reverse way. There you go. Kind of fence. So you're gonna cross the face. Good job. For well, this position, you're gonna keep continue your knees out and uh, opens up the hip flexor, and then one leg at a time or together. Yeah, keep moving. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's very, it's not an attractive exercise to warming up, but it's really uh once you do this one, uh, your performance is different and movement much easier, and they can do more uh, repetition and they can continue without having pain. All right, stop right here. And then now we're gonna go into side. Let's just dangle your arm side. Just swing it side. Just relax and switch it. And then just dangle your arm. Move. I will tell you about. It's about one minute if you have time. But you can do 20 repetitions right here, right now. Make sure kind of dangle your arm to side to side to loosen up all the muscle. Good job. Sorry. And I really, really recommend this. Not too much for warming up, intense warming up, but just slightly. Uh, um to do so so that way you're not gonna uh, prevent for the injury okay keep doing and just relax and then now we're gonna go on to the knees up and the knees up just marching starting to march yeah keep moving so see the position is gonna be alternated with the knees up there you go how are you feeling okay so that gradually increasing your heart rate okay so that march and lift it up there you go keep going now keep moving, clap your hand in the back, clap your hand in front and clap back your hand. Try to clap your back your hand, keep going, yeah, alternate it, this is the last, warming up. So that's going to be ready to go. Alright, let's go another chance. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Great job, great job, good job. And they're going to 10, four different variation of burpees. So 10 burpees, okay, so three, two, one, here we go. One. So this is one variation all the way down the floor, step back and come back up. And then second, this is gonna go and do, use a step to a little bit elevated. Very good job. All the way back, a little bit more elevation of the table, step back. Come back in. Inhale all the way up. Very good job. That's a four different last variation. And then seat. This time sitting for a piece. So step back to feet all the way out. Come back in. Four together. Jump back. There you go. Keep going. Keep going. Ten repetitions. Very nice. Make sure hands reach all the way up. So using your shoulder. Very nice. Doing great. Come on, so this is all the burpee people think is very intense exercise, but you can change a different way. You can sit in position to do the burpee this, this way, or 
you can use the high chair to use for step backs. Or you can a little bit more down to a little bit more to use a step to step back. And like if you want to do this modification for burpee all the way down the floor. I think things are ready. There you go. Good job. Here we go. We are doing for squat and a tricep extension. We have a four different variations. Uh, but well, this one is not much different. Just different uh, weights. All, all the way back is holding a water bottle. And the only thing in the posture, make sure toes are straight up, keep the engage in the core. When you squat, you make sure knees are not gonna go over the top. So keep the elbow straight up and not elbow down. Keep it stabilized. And four, three, two, great job. Posture and three, two, one, stop. Okay, now what we are filming for other side of foot switches for people using for step. So you can do for 15 seconds or 20, you can do 30 seconds and switch it right and left, right. Okay, make sure you engage in the core. And two, one, stop. Now we're gonna go in and squat, twist, extension the leg, I mean arm. So this can be oblique exercise and at the same time compound exercise. You're gonna feel the quadriceps and the hamstring and the glutes. And then basically total body, you're gonna feel the core variation, but the only thing different is just uh, weights are different. And then CV position, just keep engaging the core with twist it, twist it, okay? Another five seconds, four, three, two, Great job. This is gonna be squatting, point the toes out, and then overhead. So basically, uh, stationary jumping jack. So only thing different the jumping different is the point of toes out. Emphasize for outer thigh. So this only thing different is just way too different. Some people have no weight, some people have a lighter weight, some people have water weight, uh, butter, and some person is sitting position. But sitting position, the same thing, point the toes out and the end. All right, two, one, stop. Great job. So the center, this is modification for just regularly we do. Keep your step to the side and the bicep curl facing up. Keep a good posture. So DT onto the left side. She just step up one step. And then, so that's a little bit of, um, you can challenge. And uh, all the way back, it's, Pretend to be have a, some uh, some people have a knee issue, so you can use a little bit step to just step to the side of it instead of sitting. And now the sitting position, and uh, you can do just lift the legs up and to the side away the bicep curl. So curl it into the face, curl it into the face. Mm -hmm. All right, three, two, one, stop. Now we're going to the other side, okay? So we're gonna stay in the camera for two, three, two, one, here we go. Bicep curl at the same time, step side. Here we go, modification, we're gonna alternate it. Or you can just do one side, ten, okay? So modification is okay, alternate it. But using the step, just skip it for one step, uh, one side for ten, or fifteen. But right now we just start out for ten. All right, sit in position, and lift the legs up, and the bicep curl. <laughs> just like, uh, palms facing in, facing to the, facing, down build the curl in, instead of going this way. There you go. Camera up, uh, forgot the number, but let's go two more. And two, one, stop. Good job. Okay. Now, this is the third time, I apologize. We're gonna go into for a boxing movement, circle, uh, move away from your body. Okay, so we're gonna twist the side of two sides for 20 repetitions. All right, three, two, one, 20 repetitions. Here we go. All right, lady, keep going. So this is not a fancy movement for the legs, so just keep moving side to two side. Here we go, keep going, keep going. Sit in position the same way. Keep going, keep going. 20 repetitions side to two side. Keep engaging in four. 
more. Another ten to go. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Now we'll reverse one. So gonna face into your side. Yeah, keep going. Keep moving. It's a very really, uh, simple movement, but when you do this, you're gonna feel this. It's really inter uh, turn into the cardio. So make sure rhythm to breathe, enjoy. So make sure so you're gonna pick the good music that you like. All right, here we go, keep going. That's 10, another 10 to go. One, let's go two, and three. Move it, move it, four, let's go five, and six, and seven, and eight, and nine. You got it. All right, this is gonna be going to the last exercise on the top, side to side. This is the same thing, Matthew. Uh, it's fancy movement for the leg for this one. Alrighty, ready, set, go! Alright, this is going to be called the uh, mountain climb. They have a machine for that, so you can use for the warming up or in between transition to different next exercise. Keep going, a little bit more to go. So make sure straight up your arm and the one side can be down. And the one leg going to be up and the one leg going to be down. All right, five seconds, four, three, two, one. So this exercise is going to be between the transition and another exercise, same thing. So two different ways you can move movement. So this is going to be walking the inner thigh and then a middle deltoid. Okay, so see the position, just swing to the swing, side to side. Keep going, keep going. So that way keep the heart rate is going to be going up or stay before heart rate, okay? So you never want to stop between exercise. Five seconds, four, and three, two, wonderful job. Good, 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 keep going. Adeka, hook the elbow back and to the chin. To the chin, hit the chin, yep. Not too, make, uh, not too wide of your arm, keep it to the waistline. Keep moving. Great, great, great. See the position, same thing. Hook the elbow back, bring up to the chin. Bring up to the chin. Here we go, keep going. Let's go another 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, you got it. Okay, we're gonna continue. Now standing together the feet and the hands gonna go behind your head. And the elbow opens up. Exhale, collapsing forward, till the neck forward, stretching the spine. But you don't want to press too much, just a little gentle press. Inhale, opens up again. Open your chest, expand your head. Exhale, collapse down forward again, stretching the uh, shoulder blade. Inhale, one more time, open up, open your chest, and drop down toy. And one more time, exhale forward. I know, I know, when I count the men, how she won't believe me. And it's so, it's so. So that's the stretching for where they are going behind the wall. If you're stretching, do that. And then switch to the other side. 